Hi there, I was asked to make a video answering the question, how do you put on a cloth diaper and then what are you supposed to do with it after it's dirty? Well, we've got a willing participant here, Baby Benjamin, ready to demonstrate a few different kinds of diapers. The first one is a Bum Genius diaper. This diaper only comes in Velcro. It is a one size diaper and it has this particular one a pocket opening which means the microfiber absorbent layer fits inside a pocket opening inside the diaper. Goes on just like a disposable really. Slide it on under the baby's bottom. Bring it up between his legs. And Velcro it shut. So there's the finished product with the Bum Genius. Lots of diaper manufacturers use snaps. Snaps are nice because they don't get all tangled in the wash. This particular one is a Happy High Knees diaper, also one size. Happy High Knees are pockets once again and they come in snaps or Velcro so you can choose with the Happy High Knees. Once again, just like a disposable, really, it's not any more difficult than a disposable diaper change. Just bring it up between his legs. Now I'm going to show you the snaps here. There's a top row of snaps and a bottom row of snaps. And, oh, honey, let go. The two rows of snaps is important because it lets you customize the size, the bottom row to fit around his legs, and the top row to fit around the tummy. So it doesn't really matter what size your baby is, you can make the snap diaper fit no matter what. So there's the finished product with the snap diaper. And then the third type of diaper that I want to show you is a G diaper. G diapers only come in Velcro, but they're a little bit different in that they Velcro towards the back, which is nice once babies start to play with the Velcro and try to take the diaper off. This diaper is different in that it has a cover called the G pant, the plastic liner, which is the waterproof layer, and then I just use a pre-fold inside, but you can use a flushable insert that G diaper sells or any other kind of insert that you'd like to experiment with. So, like I said, the G diapers are different in that they Velcro towards the back. So you want to put the white liner in between his legs and attach the Velcro towards the back where his little fingers can't get it. So here's the finished product with the G diaper. And if we sit him up, you can see how the Velcro is to the back, which is nice. Okay, now I've got a dirty diaper. What am I supposed to do with it? In my nursery, behind the door, I have a trash can with a pop-up lid and a Thirsty's pail liner. Diapers go in there. When we're out and about, I have a medium-sized wet bag for downstairs. It's got a layer of pull for waterproof, zipper to keep the stink in, and a smaller wet bag to keep in my diaper bag. It fits one, maybe two. Nope, oh, gotta go. Hope that answered your questions. 